Anyway. Uh, I get because I got a town pass or whatever. And now this guy doesn't barge me anymore. So this is all new. Okie dokie, hello there gamers. We have made quite a lot, you can see things look quite different. We made a lot of progress, or at least I decided to make a lot of progress in the background because this game takes a lot of like crafting and a lot of gathering materials and a lot of this and a lot of that. So I made sure that when I came back, once I would come back, there would be some things that have been done and dusted. And that includes expanding my uh, yard, expand... Excuse me? Uh, don't forget that I have teeth, clack clack. Uh, I don't know what that was about. Uh, anyway, some character interactions happened in the background, but not a lot. Like, one character interaction was like... Nighttime, church, ghost appears and says something about something or other. And uh, anyway, uh, and I did, did, I try not to do too much that would involve completing quests, right? Except if it was a quest that would give me a recipe or a quest that, you know, it would be something important. Not, like if, if it's like story related quests or looks like it i just left alone so i i have a stamp now i have a stamp so that means i get to sell meat i have 19 bureau certificates so don't worry about that but i made upgrades all around it all around i upgraded the church now you can see like i fixed the fence it's like a, a bigger church i think uh, what day is today? That's right there. Um, yeah, it's a it's a slightly different church now, and uh, maybe a little bit bigger here, or whatever. And uh, we have a quality twenty one, a hundred and six. So there is a lot, a lot changed. But I have these things now, whatever they uh, uh, like ceramic vase with like ashes inside i forgot the name like urns whatever and uh, i have like zombies bringing in materials in any case um i've made quite a lot of progress now things i have not done that we are going to touch into this episode in town there's this right here that's a blockade it's now open i can go there there is something down there that i have absolutely no idea what it is not yet at least so we're gonna go check it out together uh we're gonna go there right now actually before i go there non-npcs you what do you need get the necronomicon okay well that's gonna take its own time its own fair share of trials and tribulations or whatever Alright, I'm not gonna lie, there is something like quite important I forgot. I have completely oversight from my part. So you can just scoot by. <laughs> so you don't have to just die in this. You can just scoot by ah, ah! There's something flying in front of my screen. Hang on. Ah, it's big. Ah, what is that? What is that? Ah, it was big and had wings. Ah, sorry. I was saying it was like a <laughs> I could just taken that the keeper's diary here we go and that's a quest item only so we're just gonna go we're, we're, oh i almost stepped on top of this again uh, yeah right so there's also an interaction with the skull guy i'm just gonna see this do you have something to tell me or no resurrection greetings blah blah blah, blah. all right whatever but yeah I, I could have taken this diary a long time ago i didn't it's here we're gonna progress a lot today, as I said before. Anyway, now, now I'll be, I'll be right back. Time skip. Yum yum. Here we go. Oh, sorry. Soon enough, I'll add rooms and tables. Ah, right. Ah, right. Anyway, yum yum. I have a stump. Uh, good. This meat just needs a little preparation at your kitchen table. Right. Story. 
Ooh. We wrap it in paper, put it on a stamp on it, and I'll gladly buy it. Oh, you bet. You bet. Mm, there we go, now we're talking. Do not ask a woman's age, and do not ask where your local mortician been bringing that delicious meat you've been consuming for the past month. <laughs> meat delivery for you, Horadek. Here we go. You get all this good stuff. Yeah, all of it. You, you get it. Yeah, you get it, my guy. There we go. Uh, this one's still There it is. Mm. Easy peasy money. Look how much wine I sold them. Like, I literally, I cannot even sell wine anymore because, you know, it, there, there's, there isn't anymore. Uh, like, uh, it, it, it values the price of the item the more you sell it. So, I'm quite sure that meat right now is not even a commodity anymore. It's just, it's just something, you know? It's, it's just something that everyone has. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, is this guy still mad? Like, yeah, probably. Anyway. All right, I will do just a teeny tiny little bit of maintenance because tomorrow I gotta go talk to the to the dude Meister, the 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 astro the, uh, the astrologian. So we're gonna we're gonna start working towards you know the Necronomicon and all that good stuff. Anyway, uh, time skip time again. All right, so a long time ago, like a long long time ago. All the way back into the Stone Age, the, the astrologian asked uh, um, for the diary, and I never, never got it to him. But I have it now. Here we go. Great, great. How many important things there must be in this book? Okay, ghost story. I haven't felt so alive for a long time. So can I have the portal open on the witch hole? Let me see. You need to craft a spirit laser. <laughs> but I don't see what a laser is, sorry. It should be crafted on the pedestal in front of the portal. You need to craft it in two parts. The emitter and, the, and a barrel. And here are the three parts of the emitter. A mirror of pride, an eternal burning coal, and a salty fork. How about second part? Second part of the book text discovered something sticky. I need to clean it off. I, I think I need some acid and restoration tools to clean it. Right, of course. There's always something else, isn't there? Sure. Um, where can I find that stuff? He wrote that his friend believed that all of these things could be found in the town. Um, I don't understand this, but he wrote that they were the soul of the town. And all sounds like a delusion to me. Magic. Ha! That's nonsense. If I were you, I'd start with something you can see. First, I check the pedestal near the portal. Second, try to get, try to get to the town and find those items. Create acid. About the acid. Uh, give up. I gave alchemy years ago. It's uh, a really dead occupation, but I think I know where you can get some acid. There should be an old woman in the swamp. Huh? She definitely is crazy, but in the distant past, she sold chemical ingredients. About those restoration tools. There may be a problem, young man. The Inquisition destroyed them. Uh, fools! They believe that the past can only bring them curses, harm and curses. But I think you might be able to find some in the black market. Somebody with criminal connections could help you. Right. Yeah, no, they, I know the guy too. Yeah. To snake. Alright, he needs those things and... Okay, 10, 10. I get an Economicon. Okay. What do you sell again? Yeah, you sell these. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I mean... Yeah, sure, why not? I'll get one. These are always good. They're always good. And what do I do with this again? Just do... Yeah, there we go. Boom. Nice. Since I'm here, might as well get apples. Alright. It's almost night time, but at least I want to step my foot into the town and see what's up. Not to mention tomorrow is... Uh, sermon Day. And then... 
perhaps I'll contribute to the to the Inquisition and give him the wine he's been asking for a long time ago. Maybe that maybe something interesting happens after that, I don't know. Or maybe the skeleton guy's gonna get even angrier with me. Who knows? Uh, I get because I got a town pass or whatever. And now this guy doesn't barge me anymore. So this is all new. Oh well, yes, yes I died, that's very perceptive game, very perceptive. Sard, what the heck was that? I, I why, why are you asking me? I think I was struck by lightning on my way to the town. Hmm. I felt it, an ancient, powerful rage bouncing on over here immediately. It would seem that someone or something of great power doesn't want you to get into town. I'm not sure. Actually, I'm pretty sure that if you keep trying, things will end badly for you. Like, I'm talking skull now too bad. Oh. But I need to go there. There's some magic items I need to track down. I need to go home. I'm a little offended that you're trying to leave me. But as your friend, I suggest you go talk to Snake. Oh boy. I think you'll be able to find these items for you. It's quite a nimble rogue. You know Snake? I talk with him all the time. I hide in on a pile of dad's calls and we talk. He thinks that I am his inner voice, so he's very open with me. <laughs> <laughs> Did he tell you anything interesting? As his inner voice, I find that he's the question's most unethical. Oh. Okay. Talk with Snake, and maybe he'll be able to help. Okay. Alright, so I thought we would be going to town, but we're not, so. Hooray or something, I guess. Um I'm gonna be honest, there's nothing to do. Like I don't there's nothing specific to do. I wanted to have more anatomy and alchemy. As you can see, it's all, you know, it's all locked. This is why I'm saving most points here, because I don't want to keep spending just in theology. And I already got most of this stuff. So... Uh, alcohol... Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe start making moonshine, I guess? I don't know. Complex fertilizer? I know, prayer for, like, retribution? I don't know, sermon money, faith? Mm. Well, whatever. In any case, um, if I could go to bed and sleep, eh, I'm just gonna chop some wood. I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, so I'm not entirely really sure exactly what else to do, so I'm just gonna get the... I'm just gonna get the uh, trade license for the merchant. And we're gonna go talk to him, like, right now. Here we go. And I have my trade license. Great, now we're in business. Between my connections and your hard work, we'll be super rich. Uh, he, you talk too much, Mike, I'm sorry. Open our first office in the barn. Seems like a startup. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, finally, something nice to do. Well, put pallets here, and I'll take crates of goods from here every... Okay, every day that you're around. Crates. That's right. We're in big business now, so we need uh, to pack our products. You are a handy fellow, and I know you have a workshop near the graveyard. I'm sure you can pack everything in nice wooden crates. You know, our trade license allows us to sell practically anything. We can sell any kind of goods. You don't need to pack all the vegetables, although the food shortage has driven up the prices quite a bit. But if you can't find some cheap labor, selling other goods can be profitable too. I'll try. Let me let me see. I think for start I can sell one crate per week. That's not much. But nobody's uh, heard of but nobody's heard of us. Uh, we'll need to invest in our marketing uh, and make our first sale. So our company has two main goals. First, increase our megaphone level to at least three. That means we'll be able to sell three crates per week. Second, sell our first seven crates. 
I'll be proud for us if we reach those goals. How can I improve? Yes. We use an ancient technique that never fails. Make a bunch of advertising flyers and leave them on an office desk. Uh, in my world, we use celebrities to boost sales. Brilliant really idea! You can ask Miss Charm to represent our company. That'll definitely work. I could also advertise our company during our ceremony at the church. Of course you could. Yeah, that's a great idea. Now, no for, uh, now I know for sure that I've chosen the right person. Yeah, right. Um, how am I going to transport these crates? They're heavy. The most obvious way to move them along the road. But maybe there's another way. I think the storage room is connected to the... Oh! But I'm a little too portly to climb down there and check for myself. Maybe I can move these crates through the tunnel. But I need to build an elevator for the crates? Okay. Okay, build. A, a fame. How do I... Never mind. Flyer. Okay, I can do that. Check. Okay. And then... Um... Fame. One. One. Fame. Ah. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's approach this with caution. And... Not caution, but with, um... Calm and collectedness. I... C crates? Excuse me? Crates. Um, sure. Wooden anvil? No. Furnace? Anvil? I already have those. Sawhorse? I have that. Chopping spot? I have that. Well, I don't need the sawhorse anymore because I have the circular. Carpenter workbench? Carpenter workbench 2. Isn't that what I already have? Maybe that's what I should do then. Right? Yeah. No, that is... Two. Okay, never mind. That's two. Um. Wine press, stone stockpile, stone cutter, potter. I have a stone cutter too. That one. Okay, paper press, water pump. Water pump? Create factory. Okay, we have the dude Meister over here. Uh, Snake, can you find me some items for me? Can you help me find something in the town? I can find anything, just name it. Okay, a mirror of pride, an eternal burning coal, and a salty fork. That's some weird stuff. As you may have noticed, I'm working on a very important project right now. So, I'm a little short on time, but if you help me, I may be able to help you. Sure. I'm looking for the restoration tools. I've, uh, I need you to find me the restoration to the restoration tools, okay? A job, how cute. How do you think you're to hire me? I've got silver, I'll pay you. Nah, I'm gonna use for money right now. If help me achieving my life goal, ah, boy. Then maybe I think about helping you. Quid pro quo, as the villagers used to say. Uh, right. So, that's a little bit of a conundrum, I guess. Um, well, anyway, I just needed, I guess, that and footage, I suppose. I'll be back in, again. <laughs> a jump cut time, I guess. Okay, so apparently I'm an idiot. I, 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 I read Create Factory and not Create Factory. So, I am just very, very dumb. Um, I, it's right here staring me in the face and I had to Google it and then in the, after finding the answer I was like, wait, what do you mean Crate Factory? And I was like, did I misread it? The answer is yes. So, Crate Factory, we're gonna make that. <laughs> it was right in front of me, as per usual. I guess I, I just gotta read things a little bit more cautiously. Oh, good. It doesn't consume a slot. That's perfect. If it doesn't consume a slot, that's perfect. And I know exactly which dum dum I'm gonna put in here. Hang on, what? Yeah. Oh, here we go. Okay, so. Okay, so this is the only things that are gonna. Box of goods. Complex iron parts. 
So I'll, I'll be selling complex iron parts? 200. Oh my. 200. Or 10 polished marbles? Sure. I have a lot of marble. I guess I can use that. I'm going to get this done off camera because, I mean, uh, I, I, I personally, I don't see that there's a point of like showing you every little thing. You already know what I'm going to have to do anyways. But let me know in the comments down below if you would like me to at least like have like a couple of frames of the objects being done and crafted or whatever, or if it doesn't matter to you or not. In any case, I'm going to do a jump cut. So I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, I almost made a mistake. I was just checking over here, and today is the Inquisitor. I need to get 10 wine before he leaves. Please let me have enough time. Please let me have enough time. Please, 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 please. Yes, 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 yes. Yes! Gah! Here's your wine. Not bad. This would definitely be the best wine I've ever drunk. Soon our cells will be full of witches. Good. How's business? So it's in your mind, thinking on how you can get more people to come here? One time during the burning of old scrolls full of useless junk like geometry, but one of them was pretty interesting. It said that everything you need to be happy can be provided by two things, red and circuses. Oh boy. Of course, this is only true for pagans. I can't imagine anyone living a happy life without the church and prayer. Still, what could be more entertaining than watching those evil witches burn? <laughs> yeah, I can't think of anything, man. Uh, you're right, you're right. And so I realized we need to add bread. Not actual bread, of course, but snacks and drinks. You're a man of business. I can imagine you can open a stand or something. All the profits will be yours. Yes! <laughs> But why should we sell? Beer, for sure. Beer's good for uh, patriotism and burning stuff. No, it isn't! Beer's low alcohol! And something with meat. That's very expensive delicacy in town. I heard you have a source of cheap meat. <laughs> but who cares about little details when we're talking about fighting heretics? <laughs> okay, I can make some burgers. Excellent. Build a tent. Fill with beer and bur burge? Burge? Oh, burgers, yeah. Burgers. Yes, burgers. I'll spread the news as soon as your tent is ready. And we've got a witch who will give them the burning of a lifetime. Sure. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, excuse me, what? Uh, what's with the other half of the graveyard? A couple of years ago, uh, it was desecrated by cultists. They had a picnic there. And I'm not sure that they're... And I'm not sure that the evil has entirely left the place. So I need to be sure that you're on our side in this fight uh, before I give you permission to use this part of the graveyard again. Okay, sure. I think I can be trusted. I am not sure, but obviously you are more trusted than most of my guards, so here's your permission. Yes. Uh, if you see anything suspicious, tell me immediately. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okie dokie. Uh, craft. Oh, what's that? Oh, we'll check it out in a second. Uh, okay, so I need uh, hemp. Wooden plank. Nails. Easy. Uh. Easy. Um, oh, oh, oh. Hey, stop sneaking around. You've been warned. Just walking around. Oh, oh, oh. There's nothing to see here. Uh, then what are you doing here? Oh, oh, oh. It's an ambush. Um, I'm not an expert, but it doesn't look like an ambush to me. Inquisitor had had bad dream about this portal and the cultists. So now we're waiting here for the cultists. What cultists? Uh, bad cultists. They're definitely connected with the witches. Help me out here, Tom. Uh, I'm gonna give Tom a different voice, I guess. They're witches, cultists. <laughs> Sorry. They're witch cultists. Ah, fuck. If they win, mm, they'll put an end to the Great Inquisition. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, this is, then we lose our jobs. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe you're, you're a cultist. No, I'm the graveyard keeper. And I'm leaving. I can't I can't check the pedestal while they're here. Okay, get rid of the cultists. 
I have no idea how to do that. How would I do that? Okie dokie, here we go. And repair the bridge. Easy peasy. Uh, however, oh, another uh, achievement. That's good. Bridge builder. Fixed bridge. Okay, so now we have this other area. This completely new area right here to explore. Which is like swampy. And there, uh, I, I remember... I remember... Someone telling me, like uh, the, the astrologian maybe, telling me that there was someone in the swamp that could help me, or could have some alchemy knowledge for me. You know what I mean? Ooh, there's a there's this thing here. What what is that? Can I can I go there? What is that? I don't know what that is. Oh please, let me let, just let me go there. Just, just let me go there. Come on, come on, come on. Just I just got here. I wanna I wanna I wanna explore the whole place. Come on. Uh, okay, uh, I'm sorry. I I have a sermon to attend to. I'll I'll be back in a second. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie, gamers. I absolutely hate the swamp. Uh, if I have to come here more than once, I, I swear to God, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my shit. I'm just gonna lose my shit. There is no reason whatsoever to make this like. In this layout. I, I mean, I get it. It's fine. It's map design. I understand. You don't have to tell me that. I, I understand that much. If you want to make something a, a little bit more cool than just like, you know, here's a straight line to where wherever you need to be or whatever. I get it. It's a little bit boring. And uh, you shouldn't, shouldn't do that, right? You should make your maps a little bit more interesting. But I don't think you need to make your maps like this. But, like, we, we all know, you and I both know, I'm gonna go to the witch's land, and then the witch is gonna go like, eh, 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 Would you like my services? Bring me 15 frogs and 50,000 skulls, and, and then you're gonna have to go here again, bring her that stuff, and then she's gonna give me another quest, and then I'm gonna have to make my way back again, and then she's gonna give me another Another quest. Ah, oh. thank you. Yes, God Almighty, thank you. Okay, um, I'm I'm going to take a picture of this because I'm very excited for this. This this just made me very excited. I can't wait for this. This is gonna be like the greatest upgrade I've done so far. Like, is, do you see all this? Useless. All useless. This is where it's at. As soon as I make this, I win. I win the game. Oh, okay. Here, here we are. Okay. Clotho. Go away, foul spirits. I'm not a spirit. I'm the keeper at the local graveyard. Are you sure you're real? Um, I guess. Not 100%, but pretty sure. I think you might be Clotho, the witch from the swamp. Oh. Since when I heard that name? Oh, that would explain one of my theories in part. Come closer, my sweet. Do I look more like a witch or a fairy princess? What do you think? A fairy princess. Great, then you can be my prince. Right. No, I'm not a prince. Anyway, I need your help. Of course you do. Um, need your help too. Too bad for you. <laughs> Remember nothing, I just woke up with this note in my hand. In case you lose your mem and in case you lose your memory, just boil the cauldron with incense and the bee. Drink the results. All ingredients should be in the cauldron already. Good luck from uh, your past you. So did, did you try it? Oh. Do you see a cauldron lying around? No. Tira. Neither do I. Tira. So, oh. you have two options here. You can either make me uh, this potion. It shouldn't be too hard. Tira. Or you bring me a new cauldron and get ingredients from me. I'll bring you a new cauldron. Where can I find a cauldron? Oh, uh, oh I need a big, I need a big one. A good blacksmith might know how to make one. Well, that that'll be me. Now uh, you help me, I help you. Might even become your princess. Ha ha. I'm thinking of a third option. Run away and never look back. Uh, you know, I wish I could. Oh, okay. Alchemy workbench. Oh my god. Finally. Holy. Fuck. 
Schätze. Okay. 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 We have something exciting to look forward to. I can't believe it. After 15 years... After 15 years playing this game, I actually have something that I'm... I'm completely looking forward to right about now. I just have to, you know, go all the way around. Oh, here we go. Okay, I was was wondering if uh, if she would talk to me now. Uh, all we need is to be confident, uh, whatever that means. Sure, here we go. Let's see how it works. Uh, I think you owe me an apology. I'm not a small man. I am a respectable graveyard keeper. But I'm also a big fan, so you just call me keeper. Pihon, hmm. Pihon. Maybe there's something to you after all. The contrast between your dirty job and your manner. Okay. She talks to me. Here we go. Nice to meet you, keeper. You. Uh, I love this. <laughs> I love this sex music playing in the background. It's so cute. It's so weird. You can compliment me, but uh, talent, but it's also on my beauty. I'd like to hear something nice. Sure. I have some questions. Ask about the snake, I guess. I met Snake at the church cellar. He was not very talkative. Maybe you can help me. I can't imagine what a normal business someone could have with that sneaky bastard. Oh. Ooh, fake coins. Okay, by the way, if you see him, please throw these fake coins to his face and then come back here and tell me how he reacted. Sure. Uh, if you insist. Okie dokie, right here by the merchant. I'm quite sure I sold at least seven. So now... Uh, the sales have been... Excuse me? Huh? Why are they still here? Why are they not sold? Excuse me? What? I'm gonna wait here, dude. I'm gonna wait, like, right here. But in fact, I'm gonna wait here. Maybe, maybe I, I have to update it. Right? But I, I got scammed. I, I, I straight up got scammed. Here we go. That is extremely upsetting. Thanks for the gold, but that was extremely upsetting. Box of goods times four. Ah, right. Gold crates. Gold crates? Oh, I know what you mean. Right, right, right. All right, as per request of the beautiful tavern lady or whatever, we're, we're required to toss fake coins into Snake's face. So, as per her request... Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. She tell you... She tell you it was just a joke? She used to be so sweet and naive. So, are you her new lover or what? Um, I just met her. And already at her... Back and call, typical. This is it? Okay. Right now I have to wait uh, until this to tell the news. Oh man, that is... It's just, it's just slightly boring. <laughs> Okie dokie, lady. I've smeared some coins, some fake coins, all over his face. Right. Yeah, it's me again. There we go. I did the thing. Snake said that it was a joke. Tell him to give back my money. Real money this time. Right. And if he can't find my mother's necklace, then the deal's off. What necklace is that? It was the only thing left of my mom. She told me to keep it. She told me that this necklace will make me happy and feel love. And I sold it to pay for a chance to sing before the king. Now I'd gladly buy it back. But I can't find it. Snake. Everybody knows he can find anything in town. So I paid him. And he took my money. Now I have no money. And no necklace either. You're a strong, intelligent man. I am sure you can find a way to help a poor woman. Sure. No questions. Yeah, okay. Sure. Whatever. Okay. Okay. Woman. 
sure thing. Okay, the day has come. And it is to the surprise of no one that here I sold more than seven. I know I did. So, let's talk business. There we go. Okay, cool. I didn't get fully scammed, at least. <laughs> the sales have been made. There we go. Alright, great. Now... <laughs> okay, sorry, I have to... Now we have a decent share of the market. This is the perfect foothold for our plan. <laughs> we still need to secure the support of the Royal Council. <laughs> sorry, I just... It's so dumb. And here, my friend, we have to come to a point where I must trust you once more. About the final plan, sure. 70. Right, so I need the hiccup grass. I don't know what this is. I have no clue what that is. Okay, so for the lady, for the lady, I need to question this dude about something or other. Ask about necklace, yeah. I was told that you could get some illegal stuff from me. I've spent the money, bought some instructions for the key, so unless you know how to turn dust into gold, then just find an necklace for her. Or can't you handle it? I'm a snake, I can handle everything. I can find everything and everyone in town. And I know where this necklace is, I just can't. You know, it's really none of your business. I need to gain the I need to gain his trust. Maybe then he'll tell me more. Uh, boy. Well, no, 30, I have it. Go. You have a very good reputation in your business. I wonder what we have gone wrong with uh, Miss Charm's necklace. Heh, <laughs> it's complicated. I'm the best there is at my job. I can find anything. Of course, there's a little bit of shady talent. A bit of a shady talent. Okay. So all these arrogant townspeople treat me like garbage. But still, they bring they. But still, they brings me their coins when they've got some trouble for me to sort out. Now the necklace has my reputation on the line. You told me you know where the necklace is, so what's the holdup? It's not in town. It was purchased under the orders from the old Lord Commander from the mountain fort. The necklace has some kind of sentimental meaning for him. That's all I've been able to gather so far. Okay. Uh, tell me about the commander. Once upon a time, he was a great warrior. He's the king's uncle. But of course, it's easy to be great when you're born in a palace and you have a father who loves you. <laughs> if you were in his place, I'd definitely be king. If I were in his place, okay. But he's just became protector of the North Pass and now there isn't even anything to protect. What about a fort? The fort in the north of the village is huge, but nowadays it's falling apart. The pass collapsed and when I was a child, I, it was the day after the Great Blast. It was the worst. But he just became protector of the North Pass and now there isn't even anything to protect. Could try and help? Uh, maybe it could help you get it back. I don't know how though. But you could brainstorm. Brainstorm? Is that some kind of spell? That could be quite useful. No, we can just think about the problem together and uh, actually, you might be helpful. Okay, you can try and get the necklace with the help of the Lord's servant, the Hunchback Kuokol. Why can't you ask me yourself? We had some kind of misunderstanding a while back. I sold him some ointment that might cure his hump. And somehow he missed the word might. He missed the world might? <laughs> so, okay. To be honest, I'm betting you'll fail. Either way, it's a win win for me. Okay. Sure. And there we go, restoration tools, give me that. I need to ask a favor in return. Sure, his restoration tools asking about. Wait, you already had them? Yep, had them when you asked him the first time. No offense, just business. Fair enough, dude, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okie dokie. All right, now, I have, okay, so the restoration tools, they're for you, right? They are, or you, yeah, acid and restoration tools. Okay, 
So I will research this acid stuff and uh, hopefully by this day I'm gonna be able to just get everything and then I'll get the Necronomicon. Okay, here we go. Today's the day we're gonna put our hands in the Necronomicon, possibly. Um, hopefully. Uh, I have the acid. Okay, here's the acid. I think it should be more than enough. Nice, very good. And the restoration tools. Hope these tools are the right tools. Not the best I've ever worked with, but it, they will do. Okay, very good. Seems that I have everything I need to get these pages apart. Just a moment, young man. A bit of acid. The young are always in a hurry, but <laughs> where are you going? There's nothing up ahead, are you sure? Gently pull the papers apart, almost, haha. Uh -huh. I've still got it. Um, let's read what it says. Here we have uh, three parts of the barrel, a necklace with a sapphire, and a golden angle, and uh, an endless notebook. Snake has the notebook, the endless notebook. Hmm, I believe I know where to get the necklace and the golden angle. Um... When I was... Wait a second, there's something else on this page. With my friend near the lighthouse, I should tell him. Esmeralda is pregnant. His child. I think I'm gonna have a stroke right now. I have a child? I may have a child. Amazing. Just unbelievable. So you've been sticking your dick around and you don't remember? Like, what about the necklace? Now, were you talking about the neck... You were talking about the necklace and the golden angle. Yes, yes. It is all connected. How strange. It might have a child, of course. By now he or she must be around. 25. But still. We were talking about necklace and a golden angle. Young man, you must help me. You must. Yes, yes. I know exactly where you can find a golden angle. I'll tell you everything. Just help me find out what's happening to Esmeralda and her child. Final help. Did you people manage things before? Let's think where to start. Esmeralda arrived here with a gypsy caravan. Oh, I know exactly who to ask for. Uh, through the Northern Pass. They can't leave because the pass collapsed. I heard that they'll still have a small camp near the mountain fort. Oh, really? You should go there and talk to her brother. He should be the Gypsy Baron now, after his father's death. Okay, uh, but... Yeah. Um, if I'm right, you used to work at the university. Yes. That's when... That's what the good old days. I think my life might have been had. I think my life might have had yeah, many. Whatever. Yeah. I can't speak. But now, nothing moves anymore. Nothing moves me anymore. I've known enough to know I'll never know enough. And besides, all that the Inquisition's rules gave become un. Tenable, whatever that means. So, in the end, I quit. Maybe to have some connections there. I need one book. The Necronomicon. Oh, young man. I took that book with me. Nobody looks after that magic garbage. So, decided to give it to my friend. He can't read, but he likes the pictures. I bet he does. Where's your friend now? Right here. The, he works as the lighthouse keeper. Oh. Oh, cool. Great. Thanks. Now I'll, I'll get one of these. Thank you. Yeah. And that's all. Thank you. Oh, wow, that was nice and easy. Okay. Book. Hi, did you still have that book the astrologer gave you? Yes, it's a big, fat book. The pictures are ugly. I'm using it as a leg for my watch. <laughs> Can you give it to me? I already made a new leg, so why not? But it's big, fat book. Judging from the pictures, it must be very interesting. But it's... I'll trade for a bunch of maggots. If I knew, I would have brought... I would have, bring, I would have brought the maggots with me. Alright, fine, whatever. Okay, don't get one Necronomicon with a large side of fries, please. Oh, that was very easy. That was like very fast. Well, uh, thank you.
Now, baby, I'll be seeing you. Let's see. Necro? Omicron. Hmm. I wonder if I go towards the skeleton with this book in hand. Is it gonna react to it? It's gonna go like, oh my lord, is that the Necronomicon? Wow. Alright, let's see. Do you say anything about the Necronomicon? Nope. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I'll see you later. Now, the, 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 the thing is, what if I could just, you know, put it in the, um, in the study table and, like, you know, study it? But of course I can't. Of course not. No, 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 no. Well, anyways. Alright, I have... Like, hours and hours and hours of footage. That will be it. Alright, we're gonna have the resolution of this Necronomicon and quite possibly the necklace and quite possibly the Gypsy Baron and the guy's child and many, many other resolutions by the next episode. In any case, that will be it for this episode. So thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. That is the bread and butter. You can also ring the bell so don't miss out any notifications of my channel. Maybe you'll catch me live next time. I do have a join button if you feel like supporting the channel even further. You get channel badges, emotes, and you keep the channel afloat for a little while longer. I do have a Discord channel. You can find all those links and everything else in the description of the video, so go check it out. There's a bunch of links in there for you to click on. And hopefully, I'll be seeing you beautiful you in the next one. Bye-bye.